Hello friends, this video is brought to you by www.mwayteaching.com. Let us read the question. Solve 6x plus 1 whole by 3 plus 1 equal to x minus 3 whole by 6. There are many different ways of solving this question. But let me teach you my way of solving this question. We can see that Two terms are rational, this one and this one, while this one is a whole number. So what we can do is, we can transport this rational term to the other side of the equality and one to the other side. Note that while transportation, the signs change, so plus one becomes minus 1 and considering this as one whole number the sign changes to negative. Now let us take the LCM. We get 6 as the LCM and 2 times 6x six plus 1 minus x minus 3 equal to minus 1. Now, minus 1 can be written as minus 1 by 1. So, let us now cross multiply. And in the next step, we get 2 times 6x plus 1 minus x minus 3 equal to minus 1 into 6. Let us open the bracket. Get 2 into 6x is 12x plus 2 into 1 is 2 minus x plus 3 equal to minus 6. Adding the like terms, 12x minus x will give us 11x and 2 plus 3 will give us 5 equal to minus 6. Let us transport plus 5 we get minus 6 minus 5 that means 11x equal to minus 11 then x is equal to minus 11 by 11 which is equal to minus 1 hence x equal to minus 1 is the required answer Let us read the question. Solve 5x minus 2 times 2x minus 7 equal to 2 times 3x minus 1 plus 7 by 2. First thing that we will do to solve this question is let us open the brackets. We get 5x minus 2 into 2x will be minus 4x minus 2 into minus 7 will be plus 14 which is equal to 2 into 3x is 6x minus 1 into 2 is minus 2 plus 7 by 2. Let us try to solve it further. 5x minus 4x will be x plus 14 will be equal to 6x minus 2 plus 7 by 2. Next, let us bring like terms together. So we get x minus 6x equal to minus 2 plus 7 by 7 by 2. 2 minus 14. So now we have 
x minus 6x will give us minus 5x equal to let us take the LCM we get minus 4 plus 7 minus 28 so we have minus 5x equal to minus 25 by 2 now both the minus get cancelled because actually we multiply both side by minus 1 so the signs will change hence we can directly cancel the negative sign on both sides that means x is equal to 25 by 2 into 5 since we are dividing both sides by 5 this will give us x equal to 5 by 2 which is the required answer